Yeah, I think Pep's, what Pep's looking at is I think he'll, he'll use his substitutes. He, he wants to win this game, get one or two goals up, and then I think you'll see the subs come relatively early. Xavi. Good chance for this well-regarded young Dutchman. Opened up for him there. It did open up as well, and he's been playing well in the Bundesliga. He's there. He's the as a coach, only Carlo Ancelotti has four. Lovely flick. Raum puts Xavi in behind here. Leipzig looking a threat. And in the end, Ortega can come and collect it. But Xavi is looking a threat, and they did that neatly. Leipzig down the left-hand side. And the five City players in the top ten in the Ballon d'Or voting. Holland at number two. With the way they've start, started here, City. Because he is a perfect... Brought away by Schlager. Gets through a lot of work in that midfield. Now, Xavi. Good defending by Klosterman. Great idea. Broken up by Raum. Xavi's lovely little ball up to Ope. Here he is again. He's taken the eye, though, with his play, and that's great by Opender again, who spins in behind Diaz. There's nobody up there with him. He might have to do it alone. He could do that. He has done it. As he shapes as if he's going across the keeper. There's the poor bit of defending, but he's still got a lot to do from that position to score the goal. And Chelsea had scored more than one goal against Manchester. It's not a great ball, it doesn't find its target in Walker. Actors can fluff their lines sometimes. In sports, TNT Sports 2, tomorrow Arsenal, Stay Hackham will be on Thursday the 14th of December at 8 o'clock on TNT Sports 3, early notice of that. For Leipzig. Taken by Xavi, Gladiol managed to get it away. Tofano again, and Leipzig's defending is good. Xavi brought down by Diaz, that has to be a free kick. He's, been, he's on a yellow yes, as well, he Diaz. He is, and that's exactly the point, of course that the Leipzig players are making to the referee, but... Uh, here's Xavi again, had a good chance himself. Forsberg helps it on. Nearly for Bernardo Silva. Good run again by Xavi. It's been quite a good chemistry between him and there. Get it past Zaybaud, who's just sat in front of the defence. Just do a little period of possession here, the German side. Xavi, lovely ball that. In the second half, there's Xavi, that little change of pace again. The Pender's square, I think he's onside there, he gets in. OK, he doesn't panic. Big money move. Shan't get it away. And this time, Xavi can't do anything more with that. Cheshko back defending this time. And here's Xavi, needs some support. One or two players arriving to help him as well, if he can get it right, which he couldn't. Yeah. White able to latch on to that. Yeah, it was brilliant play from Lewis, read it so easily and well, and just shrugged the uh, opponent off, slides a lovely... Alvarez tried to. Idaris ball wasn't the best. Uh, free kick here. Not happy about it, Xavi. Yeah, I think the ref could have played on if he wanted to, but I think still only 23. Xavi went down a bit cheaply. Sheshko tipped that over the bar. Xavi, meanwhile, stays down. Against Lawns, intriguing tomorrow, 7 o'clock on TNT 2. Newcastle. Playing Manchester Doku any longer. Xavi's in a bit of pain here, isn't he? I think his race is run. It was an impressive race, though. See the way that Xavi is grimacing there. Let's hope that is something that clears up quickly from 
their point of view. 